Summer and sure signs of lockdown lifting. I think it's a good idea. Cousins Bridget and Debbie finally able to get together for a socially distanced drink or two and a chat about the new test and trace system. Um, it does it possibly in the future involve downloading an app? Well, A, I don't have a phone and B, I couldn't possibly download anything. Would you be downloading an app? Would that apply to you? Yes, with the help of my friend Lynn, because I'm not terribly good at it. Lift the national lockdown measures. The government hoping people will get behind the test and trace scheme, overseen by Baroness Dido Harding from Somerset, married to the Conservative MP for Western Supermare John Penrose. NHS test and trace will help you establish who you've been in close contact with and so who you might have infected and will gather their contact details. That could mean people being asked to isolate out of the blue after coming in contact with an infected stranger. I would do it for the, for the public good because of my family and my friends and also all the vulnerable people. I will absolutely download the app because I think it's the right thing to do um, and it ensures that you stay healthy, your family stays healthy and the people around you stay as healthy as possible. If I go to shops and then pass it on to people, then that's where the issue rises, so, I think, yeah. Yeah, so you're on board? Yeah. Once the phone app is approved, an alert on your mobile device will ping through if you've been put at risk through close social contact with a confirmed case. For others, there's still the option of an old-fashioned phone call to try to track the virus down. Andrew Plant, BBC Points West, in Bristol.